Hey guys, it's Rick. I'm back for a haul video. It, it's been a while since I've done this, and I've got a lot of stuff stacked up here I want to show. Uh, I've got stuff from all over the place. We'll talk about it as we go through it. First couple things I want to show you is on eBay. I actually did grab a DVD. I got Snowman and the Snow Dog for Christmas this year. I hadn't seen this. Buddy Ian is high on the Snowman, says it's really good. So I want to give this one a watch. I need to get the first one. Unfortunately, this is just the second one. But I'll, I'll end up getting that. Another Christmas cartoon. I've got an upgrade. This is Halle Grinch Stole Christmas, the Ultimate Edition. It has two more specials in it. It has a Halloween special, which I've never seen. And one with the Grinch, Grinch is the Cat in the Hat. So I thought my daughter would get a kick out of that. I picked up from Amazon. I got... Tremors 2 Aftershocks. And this one was free. So, yay me. A little credit on Amazon to help with that. I also got... I'm really... Watching a lot of Sonic movies right now. I'm really getting into Sonic films uh, pretty heavily. And um, I wanted something that was... to go back to where silent films started. I've always liked A Trip to the Moon, so I ended up grabbing one of these uh, fairy tales in color, and this has about 15 of George Millet's films, including A Trip to the Moon, which I'm really glad to have. Uh, these go from 1899 to 1909, so this is officially the oldest film in my collection, or films in my collection. All right, let's go to... I got a small Hamilton book order. We got X the Unknown. Which I'll have a review coming on this. This was really good. Uh, the Vamos Snowman of the Himalayas with Peter Cushion. Uh, I've seen this back in the late 90s. Really enjoyed it. Had to pick it up. And Dracula with Frank Langella. Which I'm looking forward to watching this. It's been a long time. And The Reptile, another Hammer film that I had years ago and I'm glad to have again. All right. All those are from Hamilton Book. I've got a Kino order in. A lot of fun stuff here. First up, we've got W.C. Fields. It's the old... Actually, now take it back. This one came from eBay. Excuse me. This is an eBay uh, find. Out of print, it's the old army game, which I watched recently, and I'll have a review on that. That was a pretty good movie. Now, the rest of these are a Kino order. We have Running Wild, W.C. Fields. Silent Comedy is really good. Slapstick can work in silence. Uh, this is Old Ironsides, and kind of an, an action movie from the silent era. And I, it has Boris Karloff in it, so I'm kind of looking forward to see if I can spot him. Buster Keaton, the shorts collection. So this, uh, I do like shorts, so this would be a, a nice little set. Which, I haven't seen a lot of Buster Keaton. I have seen The General, I have seen, I have seen Sherlock Jr., and I've liked what I've seen so far. So, uh, another silent film. I got Faust, which, uh, but Ian and uh, others have recommended Faust highly to me. So every time I'm going to buy this, it's sold out. So I just said, screw it, and just ordered it. I wasn't waiting for a sale on that one. And the Premature Burial, which is um, out of going out of print, and I didn't want to miss a Roger Corman horror film that I didn't have. So that'll the Kino order. All right, let's get out my uh, McKay's haul. Got a lot of good stuff to talk about here. Final Destination 5. I had the other four and I wanted this to complete my set. Uh, I 
another silent film. I was actually this is one of the ones I was looking for. It's called Beggars of Life with uh, Wallace Berry, Richard Arlen, and Louise Brooks. Louise Brooks is an incredibly beautiful woman for her day, and uh, I'll talk more about her later. But uh, it was really, I mean, five ninety five is great for a movie especially a silent movie but th this was all trade credit so none of the stuff you're seeing from mckay's was paid for i had 170 dollars in trade credit with them and all the stuff you're seeing i think was free which is perfect a couple of criterions i got the kid brother which is uh harold boyd another silent film which i was really I'm one, there's only one more of his works I need to get. It's called Speedy. Also got The Freshman. Harold Lloyd. All right. Now the rest of these are 4K films. And when I can find 4Ks at a decent price, I grab them. We got Beetlejuice, which it's been a long time since I've seen Beetlejuice. Blues Brothers. Rogue One, which I needed to complete my Star Wars set. Saw. Halloween's coming. The original Pet Cemetery. Spiral. I wanted to see this when it came out. I never got to chance to go see it in the theater this was delayed from the pandemic but they released it this summer so interesting to see how that plays out i do like the soft series solo i had a copy of this and i ended up having to return it because it was scratched it was completely unplayable so this is a replacement copy joker which kind of have a love-hate relationship with this i saw in the theater the ending kind of bugged me but i really want to watch it again um, I, I liked his performance, though. And the last film, something I took a chance on, something I hadn't seen, which is 1917. Which I like the, I love the idea of it being a World War I film. Um, uh, the camera work from what I saw looked really cool. And, uh, I'm looking forward to watching this. All right, guys. Well, that is the haul. Probably a while before I do another one this big. But uh, just but take care. If you've seen any of these movies, please let me know. Because I'm not sure. Look, I mean, some of these, like 1917, I hadn't seen. And uh, Harold Boyd or some of the other silent films. So if you've got any feedback, let me know. Let me know what you think. And as always, go watch a movie.